Did you know that something as simple as eating oatmeal could be harming your health instead of helping it? For those with diabetes, food is a real minefield, and even choices that seem healthy can hide dangerous pitfalls. Oats are a perfect example. It is famous for being a nutritious food, and in fact, it can be a great ally in your diet. But, if consumed inappropriately, it can impair blood sugar control, causing blood sugar spikes and putting your health at risk. Just imagine, you start the day with that warm oatmeal, thinking you are taking good care of your body, but without realizing that you are making mistakes that could be harmful to your condition. Perhaps you add the wrong ingredients or consume at non-ideal times, and this, unfortunately, can make it difficult to control your diabetes. If you're tired of struggling with the scale, worrying about your blood sugar levels at every meal, and not knowing who to trust when it comes to healthy eating, this video is for you. We're going to talk about the five most common mistakes that many diabetics make when consuming oats, and most importantly, how to avoid them. These mistakes are more common than you might think, and throughout this video, you will discover how small changes can make a big difference to your well-being. So, stay with me until the end because, in addition to learning the correct way to include oats in your diet, you will also gain practical and tasty recipes to prepare two delicious drinks using this grain. These are recipes that will not only help control diabetes, but will also make your mornings much more delicious and nutritious. But before we continue, hit the like button if you love health content. Mistake number five, mixing oats with sugar or honey. Let's start with a mistake that many people make without even realizing it. Sweetening oats with sugar or honey. I know the intention is to add that extra flavor to your morning porridge or smoothie, but that's exactly where the danger lies. When you add sugar or honey to oats, you're turning a healthy meal into a real bomb for your glycemic control. For those with diabetes, every spoonful of sugar can be a trap, leading to glucose spikes that are difficult to control. Oats by themselves already have a moderate glycemic index, which means that when consumed alone, they raise blood sugar in a slower and more controlled way. But when you mix it with simple sugars, like honey or refined sugar, this effect is completely lost. What could be a healthy option ends up becoming a meal full of quickly absorbed carbohydrates, which make blood sugar soar. Sweetening oats is a common practice, especially among those who are used to sweeter flavors, but this is a change worth making. Instead of turning to sugar or honey, try other ways to sweeten your oats. Fresh fruit, like strawberries or blueberries, is an excellent alternative. They have a naturally sweet flavor without causing major fluctuations in blood sugar levels. Furthermore, fruits add fiber, vitamins, and antioxidants to your meal, enhancing the benefits of oats. Another tip is to use spices, such as cinnamon or vanilla extract, to enhance the flavor of oats without the need for sweeteners. Cinnamon, in particular, is an ally in controlling diabetes, as it helps reduce blood glucose and improves insulin sensitivity. A touch of cinnamon can completely transform the flavor of your oats, making them delicious and much healthier. If you feel like you need something sweeter but want to avoid sugar spikes, try using natural sweeteners like stevia or erythritol. They don't raise blood sugar and can be a good alternative for those who haven't yet gotten used to the more natural flavor of oats. However, the ideal is to train your palate to appreciate the sweetness of fruits and spices, which over time can become a healthy and much more beneficial habit. Now if you really like a sweeter meal but want to avoid the risks, one option is to prepare oats at night, known as overnight oats. Just soak the oats in milk or a vegetable drink of your choice, along with some fruit and a touch of cinnamon. In the morning, you will have a ready meal with the natural sweetness of the fruits already incorporated without the need to add any sugar. It's practical, healthy, and helps keep glucose levels under control. For those who prefer a hot alternative, a good idea is to prepare oat porridge with grated apple and cinnamon. Apples, in addition to naturally sweetening, are also rich in fiber, which helps control the release of sugar in the blood. Just cook the oats with water or milk, add the grated apple, and finish with cinnamon to taste. A simple, tasty, and much safer meal for those with diabetes. Remember, the secret is to choose the ingredients well and avoid the use of added sugars as much as possible. By doing this, you not only improve the taste of your oats, but you also ensure that they actually work for your health. Now that you know how to sweeten oats in a smart way, how about trying this recipe for oatmeal with apple and cinnamon? In a saucepan, 
Mix half a cup of rolled oats with a cup of water or milk. Cook over low heat, stirring constantly, until the oats are soft. Add a grated apple and continue cooking for a few more minutes, until the apple is well incorporated. Turn off the heat and finish with a generous pinch of cinnamon. This porridge is perfect for breakfast or a snack, providing satiety and glycemic control. This was just the first step to understanding how to consume oats in a healthier way. Stay with me in the next topics to avoid other common mistakes that could be compromising your health. If you like to eat well and have difficulty finding suitable recipes that won't worsen your health, I have prepared a cookbook especially for you if you have kidney disease, diabetes, liver disease, high blood pressure, among others. In this book you will find recipes for savory and sweet dishes, which will help you keep your sugar levels under control. And the most incredible thing is that they are prepared with simple ingredients that you already have at home. Start changing your habits now by making small changes to your plate. The link to this book is in the first comment of this video. Click now and get yours for less than $10. Units at this price are limited, so get yours now. Mistake number four, eating oats in excessive portions. Have you ever heard that in life, the secret is in balance? When it comes to consuming oats, this couldn't be more true. Many people, especially those with diabetes, think that the more oats they consume, the better they will be taking care of their health. But this idea, although it seems logical, can lead to an imbalance in blood sugar levels and other health problems. Let's imagine Dona Maria, a lady who decided to include oats in her daily diet to help control her diabetes. She began eating large portions of oatmeal every day, believing she was making the best choice possible. At first, everything seemed great, but over time, she began to notice that her blood sugar levels were becoming more difficult to control. What went wrong? Oats are, in fact, an excellent source of fiber and nutrients, but we cannot forget that they are rich in carbohydrates. For those with diabetes, it is essential to monitor the amount of carbohydrates in each meal to keep blood sugar in balance. When consuming very large portions of oats, the increase in carbohydrate intake can lead to glucose spikes, and this can be harmful in the long term. Furthermore, overdoing the amount of oats can cause digestive discomfort, such as bloating and gas, due to the high fiber content. Although fiber is beneficial, too much can end up overloading the digestive system. So, how can you enjoy all the benefits of oats without making this mistake? The key is to control portions and seek balance. To do this, here are some practical tips that you can apply in your daily life. Measure portions accurately, using a measuring cup to ensure you are consuming the right amount. Generally, half a cup of rolled oats is enough for a balanced meal. A good idea is to combine oats with protein sources, such as natural yogurt or milk, and healthy fats, such as nuts or seeds. This helps to prolong the feeling of satiety and stabilize blood sugar levels. Spreading consumption throughout the day is also an excellent strategy. Instead of eating a large portion of oats at once, divide it into small portions throughout the day. This can help keep your blood sugar more stable, preventing unwanted spikes. Vary the ways you consume oats. It doesn't just have to be in the porridge. You can use it in smoothies, prepare overnight oats, or even include it in healthy bread and cake recipes. This helps to diversify your diet without overindulging in portions. Finally, Pay attention to your body. Notice how you feel after consuming oats and how it affects your glucose levels. If you notice any discomfort or difficulty controlling your sugar, adjust the amount you are consuming. Now let's look at a practical recipe that incorporates oats in a balanced and tasty way. Ideal for those who need to control their diabetes without exaggerating the quantities. Overnight oats with fruits and nuts are a practical and delicious option. To prepare, mix half a cup of rolled oats with half a cup of milk or unsweetened vegetable drink and one tom or four cup of unsweetened natural yogurt. Add a teaspoon of chia seeds, half a chopped apple, and a handful of chopped walnuts or almonds. Sprinkle cinnamon to taste for a special touch. Leave this mixture in the refrigerator overnight. The next morning you will have a balanced breakfast, rich in fiber, protein, and healthy fats. Ideal for starting the day nutritiously and keeping sugar levels under control. This is a simple and effective way to consume oats without overdoing it, ensuring that you enjoy all the benefits of this food without compromising your health. With small changes to your routine, you can make smarter and safer choices for your well-being.
Now that you know the fourth mistake and how to avoid it, keep following to discover more essential tips on how to consume oats in a healthy way. If you're enjoying the tips and recipes, don't forget to hit the like button to support our work. Mistake number three, consuming instant oats. One of the biggest mistakes you can make when trying to improve your diet is opting for instant oats. With the rush of everyday life, it's easy to be tempted to choose the most practical option, and instant oatmeal seems perfect for that. It cooks in a matter of minutes and is always ready to be mixed with milk or hot water. But what many people don't know is that this practicality can be costly to your health, especially for those with diabetes. Imagine the scenario. You, in your morning rush, grab a packet of instant oatmeal, thinking you are starting the day in a healthy way. But what really happens? Instant oats go through a refinement process that makes them finer and quicker to cook. This process, although convenient, also removes much of the fiber and nutrients that make oats such a beneficial food. As a result, it ends up being transformed into a quickly absorbed carbohydrate, similar to white bread or refined rice, which raises blood sugar much more quickly than traditional oats. This difference in processing means that instant oats have a higher glycemic index, that is, they are absorbed by the body more quickly, leading to spikes in blood glucose. For someone with diabetes, this can make it a real challenge to keep sugar levels stable throughout the day. And the worst thing is that instant oats often come with additives, artificial flavors, and even hidden sugars, which can make the situation even worse. Think about João, who, like many of us, lives on the run and decided to exchange his heavy breakfast for an apparently lighter and healthier option. He started consuming instant oatmeal every day, but soon realized that when he measured his glucose levels, something was wrong. His blood sugar levels were not as controlled as he had hoped. This happened because instant oats, despite appearing healthy, do not offer the same benefits as whole oats or less processed oat flakes. So, what can you do to avoid this error? The answer is simple. Opt for less processed versions of oats. Flaked oats, grain oats, or even cut oats, known as steel cut oats, are much healthier options. Although they take a little longer to cook, they retain their fiber, proteins, and essential nutrients, ensuring a slower and more constant absorption of carbohydrates. This means that blood sugar is released gradually, avoiding spikes and helping to control blood sugar levels. And if lack of time is a problem for you, don't worry. There is an easy way to prepare oatmeal quickly without losing its benefits. A valuable tip is to cook a larger quantity of traditional oats at the beginning of the week and store them in the refrigerator. This way, you will have a base ready for several meals. The next morning, just heat and add your favorite ingredients like fresh fruit, nuts or seeds for a nutritious and convenient breakfast. For those who like to start the day with a warm porridge, an excellent alternative is to prepare a recipe for oatmeal porridge with banana and almonds. Not only is this combination delicious, it also helps keep your blood sugar levels stable throughout the morning. Here's how you can prepare it. Start by cooking half a cup of thick rolled oats with a cup of water or milk. Stir well over low heat until the oats reach the desired consistency. While the oats are cooking, mash a ripe banana and add it to the mixture. Continue cooking until the banana is completely incorporated into the porridge. This will naturally sweeten your dish without the need to add sugar. Turn off the heat and top with chopped almonds to add crunch and healthy fats, which help with satiety and glycemic control. Consuming oats correctly makes a significant difference to your health, especially if you are dealing with diabetes. Small changes, like avoiding instant oats and opting for less processed versions, can have a huge impact on your blood sugar control and overall well-being. Furthermore, these simple adjustments allow you to continue enjoying the benefits of oats without giving up practicality, and best of all, without compromising your health. Don't forget that your recipe book is waiting for you in the first comment of this video. Click now and guarantee yours. It's running out. Mistake number two, consuming oats without adequate combinations. Another mistake that many people make when incorporating oats into their diet, especially those with diabetes, is consuming it in isolation without making the appropriate combinations. Although oats are a fiber-rich food and bring numerous health benefits, consuming them alone without adding other important nutrients may not be the best choice, especially if the goal is to control blood sugar levels. Let's imagine Donna Anna's case. She started eating oatmeal every morning, 
believing she was doing the best for her health. But by opting for a simple portion of oatmeal cooked in water without adding anything else, she was not taking advantage of the full potential that this food could offer. Result, even though she ate healthy food, she didn't feel as full and shortly after, she was hungry again. What's more, her blood glucose levels were still fluctuating, which made her worry. This happens because when consuming oats alone, without proteins or healthy fats, the carbohydrates present in them are absorbed more quickly, which can cause spikes in blood sugar. These spikes can be especially problematic for those with diabetes, as they make it difficult to control blood sugar levels throughout the day. Additionally, a lack of other nutrients in your meal can make you feel hungry sooner, leading to unnecessary snacking and a higher than necessary calorie intake. The key to avoiding this mistake is to combine oats with other foods that help slow the absorption of carbohydrates and provide greater satiety. Adding protein sources such as plain yogurt, milk, or even a spoonful of whey protein can help balance the meal and keep blood sugar levels more stable. Proteins have the ability to slow digestion, which means energy from the meal will be released more gradually, preventing glucose spikes. In addition to proteins, healthy fats also play an important role. Adding a serving of walnuts, chia seeds, or a little almond butter not only improves the flavor of your oats, but also helps you stay fuller for longer. Healthy fats further slow digestion and contribute to a slower release of sugar into the blood which is essential for anyone who needs to manage diabetes effectively. Another interesting combination is to include fruits rich in fiber, such as apple or pear, which not only sweeten the oats naturally, but also add an extra dose of soluble fiber, which helps with glycemic control. These fibers mix with the liquid in the stomach and form a gel that slows digestion and sugar absorption, helping to keep glucose levels stable. And if you're looking for a practical way to make these combinations, an excellent suggestion is to prepare an oat smoothie with red fruits and chia seeds. To prepare, start by placing half a cup of rolled oats in a blender, along with a cup of milk or unsweetened vegetable drink. Add half a cup of frozen berries, which are rich in antioxidants and have a low glycemic index, a tablespoon of chia seeds, and a handful of walnuts or almonds. Beat everything until you get a homogeneous mixture. If you prefer a creamier texture, add a little more milk. This smoothie is a complete, balanced meal and ideal for starting the day with energy without causing blood sugar spikes. Including oats in your diet is an excellent decision, but it is essential to make the right combinations to maximize their benefits. By adding protein, healthy fats and fiber, you not only transform your meal into something more nutritious and satisfying, but you also help you manage your diabetes more effectively. These small changes can make a big difference in your daily life, helping you feel fuller, energized for longer, and with your blood sugar levels under control. Now that you understand the importance of combining oats with other essential nutrients, get ready for the last and most crucial mistake that many people make when consuming oats. Stay tuned, as this tip can completely transform the way you include this superfood in your diet. If you are not yet subscribed to the channel, subscribe now to be among the first to receive our next video. Mistake number one, not varying the types of oats. We come to the last mistake, which often goes unnoticed, not varying the types of oats you consume. Oats are a versatile food available in various forms, such as rolled oats, grain oats, steel cut oats, and instant oats. Each of them has its specific characteristics and understanding these differences can make all the difference in controlling diabetes and your health in general. Imagine the situation of Mr. Carlos, who always opted for oats and fine flakes, believing that any type of oat would offer the same benefits. He ate the same oats every day, without realizing that varying the types available could bring a series of advantages. Over time, he began to notice that his blood sugar levels were not as controlled as before, and that his digestion was not as good as he had hoped. This is because, although all forms of oats are made from the same grain, their processing is different which directly impacts how the body digests and absorbs them. For example, instant oatmeal, as we discussed earlier, is highly processed, which makes it quickly absorbed and can raise blood sugar levels more quickly. On the other hand, steel-cut oats are minimally processed, keeping their fibers intact and offering slower digestion, which is ideal for keeping glucose levels stable. By varying the types of oats you consume, 
you can enjoy different benefits. Cut oats, for example, are an excellent option for breakfast, as they provide energy more consistently throughout the day. Flaked oats are ideal for preparing quick recipes, such as smoothies or cakes, without losing nutritional value. Oat grains, in turn, can be used in soups or salads, adding an extra dose of fiber and nutrients to your meals. Another important point is that varying the types of oats also helps to diversify your palate and avoid food boredom. Following a strict diet can often be challenging, especially when options are limited. Trying different types of oats, combined with a variety of ingredients, can make your meals more interesting and enjoyable, helping you stay motivated to eat healthy. Now, if you're wondering how to start varying the types of oats in your diet, a practical suggestion is to include cut oats in your breakfast. Here is a recipe for cut oats with fruit and honey, which is simple and nutritious. To prepare, start by cooking half a cup of cut oats in two cups of water or milk. Cook over low heat for about 20 to 30 minutes, stirring occasionally, until the oats are soft and have a creamy texture. While the oats cook, cut up your favorite fruits like apples, pears, or berries, which are great for adding flavor and nutrients. When the oats are ready, add the fruits on top and, if desired, a drizzle of honey to sweeten. This breakfast is rich in fiber, vitamins and antioxidants, and helps keep blood sugar levels balanced throughout the morning. Remember that the key to healthy and effective eating, especially for those with diabetes, is variety and balance. Varying the types of oats you consume not only increases the nutritional value of your meals, but also makes your diet more interesting and enjoyable. With different ways of preparation and an infinite number of possible combinations, oats can become a versatile and constant food in your routine always contributing to your health in a positive way. Now that you know all the mistakes that can be made when consuming oats, you are prepared to make more conscious and healthy choices. With this information, you can enjoy all the benefits of oats without compromising your health, keeping your diabetes under control, and enjoying delicious, nutritious meals. Now that you've learned how to avoid these common mistakes when consuming oats, you're one step closer to improving your diet even further and keeping your diabetes under control. But don't think it stops here. If you found these tips valuable, you can't miss the next content I prepared for you. I'm leaving an incredible video on your screen about the seven best teas for diabetics, which will transform your routine in ways you can't even imagine. These teas could be the missing key to further balancing your blood sugar levels and improving your well-being. Don't let this opportunity pass you by. Click and watch right now. See you there.